Hi, this is Mike Haber. Thanks for asking me, if I didn't do it, can I still be charged with a crime? In a perfect world, only those folks who actually commit a given crime should be arrested. But the world is far from perfect, and so too are far too many arrests. I recognize that some cops are bad. They can allege anything they want, make any arrest they want, conjure any story they want. But I also know, not believe, but know, that it's a very small percentage of police who engage in this sort of behavior. I also know that when a bad cop acts, the vast majority of her or his colleagues are going to be the first ones to call that cop out. And the reason is actually quite simple. One bad cop reflects horribly on all police. And this creates a whole hell of a lot of problems for the larger group, ranging from simple distrust to outright aggression. By policing themselves, cops know that they can have the best possible relations in their communities, not to fail to mention the best odds at making it home safe and sound to their own loved ones after a given shift. As an aside, let's not isolate cops. It's a sad fact there are bad actors in every walk of life. For instance, there are plenty of abhorrent athletes. Consider Aaron Hernandez or Tanya Harding. There are deranged doctors. Consider H.H. Holmes or Joseph Mengel. There are lousy lawyers. Consider Scott Rothstein or Alex Murdaugh. And there have even been a few abominable astronauts. Feel free to Google Lisa Marie Nowak. While I personally believe that all dogs are born innately good, some simply need to be put down, although that's usually because they were abused by some human, but that's another discussion for another day. Getting back on point, yes, far too many bad arrests happen. Again, sometimes this is due to nefarious conduct by a bad cop, but more often than not, in the vast majority of times, it's simply a matter of bad assumptions bad luck, and is like, I like to say, the convergence of the three wrongs, or being in the wrong place at the wrong time, and coming into contact with the wrong cop, albeit not necessarily a bad cop. So, can you be arrested even if you didn't do anything? Yes, but you can also reduce the odds by being mindful of where you go, who you go there with, what you choose to do, and should it come to pass, then how you opt to interact with law enforcement. While you cannot control what John or Jane Q police officer ultimately chooses to do to you, you do have absolute control over your own words and your own actions. That said, I thank you for your question. I appreciate your having asked it. Please remember that at Haber PA, it's all about reasonable doubt. And if you like this video, then subscribe to our YouTube channel. We'll be putting out more soon.